I'm joined by Glamorgan all-rounder Jack Rudolph. Uh, Jack, good performance tonight. I thought um, as far as the season's gone, it was potentially one of our best performances, considering we've uh, lost Graham Wag and Wayne Parnell. Um, I thought our bowling unit really stood up tonight, um, even with the likes of myself and Colin. Um, I thought we really did well, and uh, it's, uh, hopefully we've turned it around. We've got three games left, and uh, hopefully we can still get into the quarters. Obviously, you opted to, to bat first and set that target. Really, it was yourself and Craig Mesher doing those final couple of overs that, that set the target, but was just out of reach for Hampshire in the end. Yeah, I thought um, with, with missing out Graham and uh, Wayne, who are actually strikers at the end, um, I thought it would be better off if Colin opens with me and we send uh, Mesh further down because he's the one guy on our team who can at will eat sixes um, and he showed it tonight that he can do that. So I thought his innings really got, gave us some momentum going into our bowling um, to just really get us in front of them. It was a license to hit for him, wasn't it, when, when you kind of left him there with a couple of overs to go four sixes in the end. He was striking the ball so well, wasn't he, all parts of the ground. Yeah, like I said, he's a clean striker of the ball and I'm really happy for him. I think uh, he would have liked to score runs opening the batting, but um, he's really done well for us. And I think especially now that Graham's not here, he's got a great role for us to play in the middle order. Well, just to obviously mention to the bowlers, really tight there, particularly in those final 10 overs, restricting Hampshire in the end, 25 runs short. It, it was a spin that did it, wasn't it? Just really it took the pace off the ball. Was that the plan with this pitch? Um, yeah, I've made comments this week that we're potentially going to bowl 16 overs of spin, losing two of our frontline seamers. But um, I must say, after that first six overs, uh, they were batting at 10 runs and over. And I just said to the guys, we just got to make sure that we stay nice and calm. It just takes one week and all of a sudden the momentum changes and the run rate went from 9, then lost the wicket, all of a sudden quickly to 11, 12 and then they were under pressure, not scoring boundaries. Um, so I think in terms of a bowling performance, the fact that we stayed calm uh, was crucial. Jack, I'm going to let you know, I know we're celebrating Mr Ingram's birthday back up in the dressing room, so enjoy that and good luck for next week. Thank you very much. I'm gonna...